like we've been to this house before. How many times has it been, guys? No, oh, they all look the same, I think. I'll try the back door. Wait here a second. Oh shit. This guy ain't playing. Side window's been jimmied. Looks like somebody's creeped the joint. Alright guys, welcome back to LA Noor. I'm gonna be uh, cranking these videos out. We ain't we ain't playing around. Where are we going? Where are we going? Bunch of broken bottles in this bitch. Uh-oh, Hill. Give me that brand. Size nines. It's a female Above shoe, size nine. Is this gonna be a Cinderella story? Does it does it match? Okay, the back door was busted. Or the side window. I don't know what it was. It's right here. Yeah. Broken glass. Burglar used the pry bar. Why did you kick the door in? You think I'm gonna climb through a broken window in a $30 suit? You got another thing coming, Buster. $30 suit? Jesus, was it really that cheap back then? Doesn't give me anything to go on. As Carl Malone once said, the only thing that's in sync is dirty dish. Selene and Jacob are obviously. That's one hell of an problems. address. It speaks to motive. Crime scene evidence still weighs against it being the husband. Jacob could give us something to go on. One of my exes drank like this and could feel on the back of my hand. Everyone has the Call same stuff. Get technical Look at this. services out here. I'll talk to the neighbors. Don't take all day about it, Phelps. I get nasty when I'm thirsty. So we're supposed to talk to the neighbors. Let's start with this one over here, I guess. Let's go to their front doors so it's not creepy. Anything? No, well they're not home. Shit. Let's try the uh I oh actually the neighbors over here. Hang on. I guess it's way back here. There's only one neighbor that we can talk to. Oh her! Never mind. She was standing there the whole time. I didn't even notice. I knew it wasn't safe around here anymore. LAPD. Are you acquainted with Celine Henry, Miss Horgan! Jennifer Horgan! I've known Celine for more than 10 years. Our children grew up together. What's going on, officer? Did you see Mrs. Henry go out last night? Well, I'm no busybody, you understand, but Celine had been drinking. And she and poor, long-suffering Jacob had a terrible row. I think Jacob may have given her a black eye. He stormed out and she went back inside. Did he come back? No. Celine was listening to music and shouting until she left around 10 p.m. She was very drunk to have been driving. But she is not the sort of person you can stop from doing something when her dander is up. What is this about, officer? Is Celine all right? I'm afraid Mrs. Henry has been murdered, ma'am. Murdered? Oh, my God. I'm afraid I need to go and then sit down. She's guilty. So they had marital problems. Can I steal that car? All right, let's uh, let's go back in the house and just double check, make sure I searched everything. I searched there. Oh wait, I didn't search. Was this like a bedroom or something? Hang on, where are we at? Oh, it is. What the hell was that? What is this thing? Oh, it's a hair dryer? No. Possibly, I don't know. Oh, hang on. Whoa, what was this? Something happened. It's 
Tiffany. The rest of the stuff is junk. Might explain the missing ring. I feel like the rest of this stuff's just meaningless. I feel like I grabbed the thing you're supposed to look at first, and that was it. I got the brush. That's not a brush. No. I always think it is. Everything else seems in places. I guess it could be. There's an office back here, I think. What the hell is this? Circumstantial. Circumstantial? What does it even mean? Can I play piano? Oh, that'd be so sweet. It's just like my Max Payne 3 intro. What the hell was that? Hey, whoa, hang on. Family burnt to death. Cops say house fire deaths are suspicious. Backstory. You said I had to go back, doctor. The fires are cathartic. They allow you to confront your past. You said the house would be empty. Are you taking the medication I have prescribed? You said the house would be empty. I heard them screaming. The circumstances were unfortunate. My colleagues had made all the necessary arrangements. You said the house would be empty. You're killing me. The deaths were unfortunate. But you have dealt with death before. I want you to come to the clinic. You said the house would be empty! How can I find peace? That was a pretty quick backstory. Usually it's like a couple of minutes. Alright, so 4 out of 13 newspapers collected. Let's go. Do we need to talk to anybody else? Any other neighbors? Really, it's only the ones that would have actually been able to see, I guess, someone break in. You know? Because it happened back here. Okay. I don't know who else to talk to. Did she tell me who it was? Nothing else? No? Alright, it's saving. Something's happening. Something's taking place. This is her place. Should I go bump on the door that was next door to them? Shit, I don't know who to go talk to. Let's see what Jacob it's has to say for himself. Soap, you know? I don't think Jacob is our man, but we should see what he has to say. Someone had to have seen something. Let me go back and bump on this house, and then I'll have to see what's going on. Because right now, I have no idea who to talk to. I bumped on this door before I talked to the woman. Maybe, maybe now it's going to trigger something else. Nothing. Shit. So the only thing I can think to do at this point, uh, the music stopped, I investigated the neighbor, I'm gonna go to H Jacob Henry's apartment and see what we can find there. If we can find this guy. Don't need this? He's already in the car when like everything stops, I see. Uh, yeah, that's how you know like shit's progressing when he gets in the car and waits. Alright, I'm letting You're him drive, I ain't wheel. driving. You think I'm driving? Oh, shit. Jacob Henry. Okay, Phelps, we go in hard. You follow my lead. Which apartment is his? Okay, we're getting close. I'm gonna follow him. You Jacob Henry? Yeah. Who's asking? LAPD. You're under arrest for the murder of your wife, Celine Henry. Murder? Celine? Save the dramatic oh, my for RKO, God. pal. You got bigger problems. What the hell are you talking about? You, you come in here, you, you tell me that Celine is... Take a seat, Mr. Henry. She's, We're going to have a look around, uh, then we'll talk. Jesus, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, uh. All right, we got to find something to tack onto this guy. Uh-oh, what was this? 
the alcoholism illness. Optimistic colitis ended your flight as well. What kind of dog was that? Hang on. That's a pretty badass looking dog. I'm kind of jealous. Hey, what is this? It looks like a note or notepad. What? You think the atmosphere is thick in here? Wait till you try the gas chamber. Oh. Oh, shit. This reminds me of the Big Lebowski. <laughs> when he did it. Oh, that's such a. That's such a weird thing to, like, talk about. He'll be back in a the Fuck? Who writes this. this hard? You know what I'm saying? Like. The oldest problem there is. What to do about the old lady? That's a death threat. Oh, shit. That's why you never leave paper trails. Happy trails, Hans. Anything else here? I didn't see anything at the, uh... Let's check back here. What is all this? Those are some nice shoes. Size 11. Size 11s. Uh-oh. Music stopped. A little chime happened. Let's go ahead and talk to him really quick. What time is it? Okay, it's... We got plenty of time to question this dude. Here we go. So who could have killed Celine? Where did she go last night, Jacob? A bar, I suppose. Look. I don't know. I'm not sure if I have the evidence to back it up, but I do think he's lying. Let me try a lot. I'm just gonna see what I got. I'm gonna take I'm taking a risk. You know where she went, Jacob. You're lying. Why would I help you if you keep lying to me? Look, I'm telling you, I don't know. Oh man. Uh what about the husband's alibi? Yeah, how about that? That's like the only thing I could think that would actually work. Let's try it. We know she went to the Bomber Club. <sighs> the bartender there. He, he calls me if things are getting out of hand and I go and I bring her home. He called me last night. I said no. Phone rang a couple more times after that. I ignored it. I'm gonna have to live with that. Uh oh, shit's getting tense, guys. Last contact with the victim. When did you last see your wife, Mr. Henry? Last night. I went to see her. We talked. Things got a little out of hand. I left. Bullshit! What about that death threat? A little note we found. I'm, I'm gonna say he's lie. lying. I know it. You tailed her, watched her come out of a bar, and then beat her to death. Admit it, Henry. Why would I do that, Detective? Well, what about the note? So I, uh, why, why would you use size 11 shoes? What kind of... You have size 11 shoes. That's why, bitch. Death threat! My wife was a drunk. It was a sickness with her. Doesn't mean I didn't love her. Would you stop loving your wife if she was unwell? No. So I we wouldn't. caught the murderer really quick. Motive. For what? Last contact with victim. What? Why did you kill her, Jacob? Things will go better if you come clean about it. That's a lousy thing to say. I never gave up on my wife. Hang on, let me... I gotta use intuition just because... I have a chance to. I had no idea. I got the last thing wrong. Okay, so I'm gonna go with lie. Let's try that. Why did you kill her, Jacob? Things will go better if you come clean about it. That's a lousy thing to say. I never... gave up on my wife. I don't believe you, Jacob. 
I think you didn't have the guts to do it yourself, so you had someone else do it. You want to back that up with something, Big Mouth? Huh? Well, I mean, the death threat note, I thought I was supposed to use it last time. I guess I'm gonna use it again and see what happens. That's the only thing I can think. It's gotta be right. The note by the phone suggests you meant her harm. You want the truth? Truth is, I was sick to death of her. I was trying to have her committed. We're still gonna need you to come downtown, Mr. Henry. We can get this all down on paper, Jacob. How you got fed up with your wife and how you figured killing her would bury all your troubles. Kill my own wife? She was a loss of the trap and you just couldn't stand it anymore. Shut your goddamn mouth! <laughs> so now you're gonna tell me you loved her? Ah, the DA goes all gooey over remorse, Jacob. <gasps> oh, shit. Son of a bitch, come here. Ah, what you know about it? Fight night, this bitch. Call it in and get a squad car dispatched. And check for messages. I'll keep old Slugger here company. All right, let's make a phone call. Where, where was this phone at? I remember seeing it. It was close by. Here it is. Here it is. I feel like it was too easy. Operator, give me Even dispatch. though I got one wrong. Putting you through now. Phelps badge 1247. I need a patrol unit to transport a suspect back to Central. Certainly, Detective. You have a message from the coroner. Do you wish to be put through? Yes, ma'am. Carruthers. It's Phelps. I've completed the autopsy. Several wounds to the head from a blunt metal instrument. Closest match would be a socket wrench handle. So the cause of death was the blunt... No, the blows to the head surprisingly were not fatal. Death was from hemorrhage and shock from the fractured ribs and multiple injuries caused by the stomping. Anything else? He's some kind of sex fiend. The tissues of the anus were bruised about one-eighth of an inch, but no trace of semen in the anus, vagina, or stomach. Thanks, Doc. Operator, give me R&I. &D. Any word on an owner for that vehicle? License was 2Boy8899. Yes, Detective. The plate belongs to a brown 1936 Pontiac. Registered owner is one Alonzo Mendez of 402 South Fremont Street, apartment 16. Thanks. Any other messages? One, Detective. From Captain Donnelly. He wants any and all suspects returned to Central. Interviews to be set up immediately. Got it. We're coming in. Okay, so we got two places we need to go, I, I think. Let's go to Mendez's apartment first, and then Central Police Station after that, if we even need to. I don't even know, like, usually some stuff, oh, my voice just got crazy. Usually some stuff's not really you necessary. Drive. I need to go over the case notes. I ain't going over shit, I'm just trying to get there quick. The in the glass and on the tongue. Enjoy All right, let's see where he lives. Which apartment is it? 16, here we go. Mendez, apartment 16. So I guess we're going uh, up top, maybe? Wait, let's see. He lives on the fourth floor. Okay. Here. The apartment's up on the top floor. Alright, here's the second. Actually, this would be the second. Let's just keep going up these steps. Oh yeah, thank you guys so much for the likes. If you want more, just keep dropping it. Uh, I'm gonna keep cranking these out as much as I can before I go absolutely insane. Wait, 14. Yeah, this is the, this is the right one. 13, 14. Don't bother knocking. Just get the door in. Take a look around and see what you can find. We're not even gonna like try to 
Oh shit, look at this. This door is like golden handle like crazy. What the fuck is this? Oh shit, there's the lipstick. Brothers can match the color and brand of the body. What's that other thing he's got right there? Is this, that, that, that can't be the wrench. Consistent with Celine's injuries. Socket wrench. Oh shit. We have the murder weapon. We better get Pinker down here. Why keep it? Why not throw it away? Think these clowns are geniuses? Oh, he's here. Thank your stars you caught a break. Captain Donald would begin to like you. Hey! What gives? LAPD, you're under arrest. Oh shit. Do are not you lose that son of a bitch. I'll go get our wheels. Ben Look at him, he's on right foot, there. he's gone, he's gone. Come on, come on. How is he so fast? You know, you you actually know how it's about to end. He's either gonna get shot. Come on, don't need come to do on. this, Alonzo. All the birds flying away. Some like John Woo shit right there. There he is. There he is. There he is. Get in and drive. Fucker, man. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. There he is. Come on, you bastard. Oh, shit. How did he turn on a dime like that? <gasps> Be careful. I almost flipped my car. Thunder Road right here, baby. I got baby. an idea. Get him next to my window, Paul. Keep me alongside his vehicle, and I'll stop this son of a bitch. I gotta get a little faster, though. Your partner will attempt to disable the fleeing suspect. Hit him! Clean this asshole off the road! Help! You gotta get me closer! I'm trying! Is that him? Hit him, Cole! Spit him out! Where you think you're going? You're under arrest for the murder of Celine Henry. I ain't saying a goddamn thing. You did a grand job, lads. Phelps, that's quite a way to acquit yourself in your first outing as a homicide investigator. It seems the city has a new and vengeful guardian. Considering the evidence against your suspect and the thoroughness with which a report was compiled, I foresee a safe passage through the courts, and the DA agrees with me. Brutality on a scale such as this deserves retribution. The people and the press of this city demand it. Oh, we, so we, we didn't get 100% on this, but it's all good. I didn't even have to go interrogate the other guy. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for all the likes. If you want more today, just keep it up, and I will deliver. Take it easy, guys.